Hello there, I'm the Star Wars guy, and welcome back to Grand Arena Championships on my main account. Um, I will apologize ahead of time. I am feeling a bit sick. I have a little bit of a cough. If I have to cough or break for water or something, that's just what's going to happen. Like right now, water break. Freaking water breaks will stop me from coughing. All right, let's do this. Now, being sick is never going to stop me from making videos for you guys. So check this out. On the north side, we have a decent Jedi Knight Revan team, Night Sisters, Newt with Nest. If you watched the last episode, that is an annoying combo. That exact same team. <coughs> and then Bounty Hunters and Geos, we're going to tackle them first. Bounty Hunters, we, you know I like using my CLS squad. It's kind of a CLS hybrid squad. It's kind of, well, really, it's an old CLS squad. This was, this was a popular comp uh, before Chewie came out. Now Chewie's out. Interesting, we see Zam and Aura Sing. You don't usually see those two. Let's stun Boba. Oh, resisted. It's all right. We got him on the counters and stunned him anyway. Nice job, Boba. You really messed that one up. Let's get that up. She's getting that health back up. Come on, stay on her. We can kill her right here. Boom. She's gone. Boba. You're gone. Gone once. Let's get him before he can, uh, before boss can taunt, because that's coming. Boom, Boba's gone. Here comes boss taunt. It's done. Ah, oh, resisted. Now, we know CLS can attack out of taunt. I'm going to stay on, uh... Stay on Bosk for now anyway. Let's get that stealth moving. Okay, here we go. When Han's up, it's time to roll. Boom. Big hit from Han right there. Didn't even have to hit him the second time. Alright, Aura. You are an awesome character, but you must die. Love Aura Singh. Particularly in the Clone Wars. Yeah, alright. Dengar and our, our bounty hunter destroying with CLS streak continues. There we go. Boom. 56. Not bad. We're going to take out the Geos with my Vader. And you know what? We're just going to go Palpatine, Vader. I'll throw Thrawn in there. I don't think... They're going to need it. Here we go. Force Crush. Merciless. Kill GBA. It's over. Right there, it's over. Who do I want to kill next? Spy? Gone. Hundred percent could have soloed these guys with Vader, and in the future we might do that. Let's kill Poggle Fracture. Oh yeah, we can only target the brute. That's right. <coughs> uh, I missed the taunt. I didn't see the taunt there. Just basic. Doesn't even matter at this point. All right, sixty-one. Nice. Now, what does the back hold for us? Is it surprises? It is. There is a strong Padme team. Glad I saved my Padme squad for that. Or not my Padme squad. My Grievous squad. The Grievous versus Padme can be somewhat hit or miss. But this Padme squad does not look like it's going to be too much of an issue. They're not like full, full relics or anything like that. those AoEs flowing. Now, GK on a on a Padme team is so, so annoying. C-3PO over there hurting. He's never not taunting, and he always has just a billion protection. Now, 
we stay on him right here. Ah. Let's get Padme out of there if we can. Before he taunts up again. Yep, there you go. That's how it goes. With the droids, we basically just try to overwhelm with pure, pure force. And a lot of AoEs really help. Grievous, B2. Yeah, pretty much everybody on this team has one. Except Magna. C-3PO's gone. <coughs> Padme's hurting. She was. She's back up now. Now's your chance. Hang in there, B2. Hey, Kenobi is really saving them, huh? Oh, that sucked. Come on, big AoE. There we go. All right, Grievous. Hang in there, dude. Into these battles, get nuts. She's gone. Kenobi versus Grievous. How, how much cooler could this be right now? This is the battle with a better outcome. Nice. Well, it kind of sucked there at the end, but we got through it. Stronger Padme team. They thought they could uh, kind of trick me up there in the back. All right. Who do we have left? My plan was to use Padme for JKR, Geos for Night Sisters, and um, who was I going to use? Oh, Night Jedi Knight Revan for the Newt team. But I don't know who I'm going to kill that First Order team with. Could use my first order team, but they kind of outclass me a little bit there. Yeah, we're gonna have to mirror match that. All right, well let's let's focus on the north side here. We got Padme up against this JKR team. This should not be uh, too too difficult. Jolie out of there quickly. And whoever we kill, we're going to have to kill twice. That's not going to be a problem because the Padme team does really good damage. Hermit Yoda, we don't have to worry about. He'll disappear at the end if we kill the other four. Boom. Alright, now they can't revive. Let's get Revan next. Although Yoda's also pretty damaged, but he's going to always be hiding behind either Stealth or Foresight. Yeah, look at that. Very nice. Or both right now. He's hiding behind us in both. Who needs it? All right, Yoda. You've been annoying long enough. <coughs> there we go. Not bad. We're going to be able to kill the Night Sisters very easily with these Geos. I say very easily. We'll see how it works out. I've never had a problem with this. unlimited reviving taunting thing that is the zombie not fun that's one she gets two that's two there we go Talzin next massage you're gone Talia killed on the counter attack Oh, killed on a counterattack again. <clears throat> that took like 10 seconds. All right, now this one. This one's going to be interesting. 
Newt. I'm going to throw my JKR up there. Now, they're not the strongest, but if we look at their squad, they're not either. Django's not full stars. Watt's not full stars. Does Watt have the Zeta? He does. So he's going to go first. Now, the only issue is my Revan squad is not the strongest either. So we'll see how it works with Nest. I'd like to get Newt out of there quickly. Django just sits back there with damage immunity. Ooh, and that's smart. Newt's gone. Newt's back. Watt out of there. Very nice. Okay. Django. Uh oh. Your boy has extortion over there. Well, their nest is not fully maxed by any means. Pass that four side around. Look at all those buffs. It's done. Nest is gone. She was the one I was worried about. With her gone, I can breathe a little bit easier knowing that we got this. And Dooku. Gone as well. Alright, not bad. 58, that brings us to ships, right? Now, this was interesting. I forgot to point this out at the beginning. If you go back to the very beginning of the video and look at the score, uh, he only placed one fleet, meaning that I had more points right out of the gate because I placed two. And now I only have to kill one to full clear him. Uh, that was kind of an odd choice. Um... We'll see. I have two fleets I can throw at it. I'm very, very close to having Negotiator ready to go as a backup fleet. Yeah, I'm just going to go. I'm just going to go with the strongest. Well, no, you know what? I'll go Dark Side. Okay, and Mace Windu. Interesting choice. He's saving Negotiator Malevolence for offense, which makes sense. Good lord. Get some vulture droids on the field. We gotta get Anakin out of there first, you know. Kill him right now. That's it. Boom. He's gone. Ahsoka. You're next, girl. I love the malevolence. I love being able to call out vulture droids at every, basically every move it makes. Get Hound's Tooth out here. Here comes air reinforcement. Rex. Clone Sergeant. Yeah, I guess it's not blue. Rex's is blue. Houndstooth can tank all their damage. Let's get a uh, spark, charge, whatever it's called. Now we have two teams left on offense to try to kill that First Order team with. And it may take both of them. I'm banking on the fact that I, I hope my gas team can hold that bottom sector for us. And the fact that he didn't place two fleets. <coughs> Means that we should get a pretty good score here. Alright. So we're going to go First Order Mirror Match. I do not think my First Order can beat their First Order. But I think we can hopefully get rid of at least one or two characters in the background. And then we can clean them up with my Scoundrel Squad. So let's see what happens. Go after maybe maybe Foo or Hux first. Not going to be able to kill their, their crew, probably. Now they're faster than us, that's for sure. Jeez.
Hmm. I'll go after Hux. You know what? We might as well try to go after Crew, because he's going to be taunting the whole time anyway. This is, this is ugly so far. Hux is a powerful addition to the First Order. They are just out moving us right now. We can't move. This plan is going horribly. Yeah, okay. We're, we're screwed. Get rid of the taunt. It doesn't matter. He's going to heal back up before I can do anything. We're going to throw the scoundrels at him. I don't know that they're going to be able to do it, but my nest is gear 13 now. Seems like everybody's Kylo Ren Unmasked gains health when they get hit, except mine. Alright, we're gonna go shock for just just power, not synergy, of course. And we'll go um we'll go Dooku for stuns. How about that? Hodgepodge little team there. I don't expect this to work, but I think we're gonna win either way. And they got all the turn meter loading as well. Please hit nest with bonus attacks. There we go. Nest with a big hit. And he's got buff immunity. Oh, and we have counterattacks. This might work. Nest, Shock, and Dooku. Dazed. Love it. Come on. Yeah, look at him gain health. Everybody's crew gains health but mine. Of course, that's not how it is. That's just how it seems. Look at that. Look at that. One of the more annoying characters in the game. All right, let's go for the peripheral right now, then. Might be too little, too late. Hux is gone. They're chewing through us. No way. Come on. Hang in there, Kira. One more move. Nest on a roll. Look at these hits. Dazed him. Big hit. Here we go. He's gone. We did it. I can't believe it. I did not expect that to work. Shock T and Nest for the win. Look at that. There we go. We full cleared him. And we got 2090. So we'll see how my team does. I, I hope this uh, that gas team there, I hope they'll they'll hold the south territory for me. And I actually did place two fleets. So they're not very good, but they're there. So he's going to have to have something to fight with. Okay. That's fun. Uh, I feel like we did good. We might have won. We'll see. Uh, so there you go. I'm the Star Wars guy. Thank you so much for being here with me today. Please subscribe below for more Star Wars content every single day. And I'll see you guys in the next video.